I've started making my handles for my cabinet doors. There's all the corks. We're going to fill in all those holes there. I made me a, a template for the top so I can make drill the holes as as center as possible. So I think I got it where I want it. And I've already put two of them in so far. Two little bolts, I order those online. Cheaper than the hardware store. And then I'll show you the how that's gonna go in a little while. Actually I bought this strip here. Aluminum stripping. I marked it, marked them all. If you can see them, there's the marks, black marks, black marks. So I'll cut those individual pieces out of this. It's over two inches long each piece. And then that will go on the back of one of these. Also put the hinges back on today, this morning. So that little cork will go through here. Through the front, push the back. And then that aluminum stripping I just showed you will go on the back here to uh, reach each edge here so that when you pull it won't pull the cork out the bolt comes through here I'll drill a hole in those aluminum strips and then the nut will go on there and it'll pull it snug I'll probably have to notch out a little of the cork to fit those pieces those aluminum strips there they'll be brackets they won't be strips so it's fun it's coming along I'm happy with the color of the the doors should go nicely and uh, tomorrow I should have the the nuts coming in on a different day the ship coming in tomorrow I got electric fuel pump coming in tomorrow I think my old one is is uh, working intermittently, so it's cheap enough. It's only about I was like eighteen dollars for the pump, so that'll work. I've got a fuel filter for it the other day, so everything's new except for the fuel pump. So I'm going all new fuel line. So I'm going to get back to putting some more holes in these corks put my little bolts through it after that and then <clears throat> secure them on there on Monday right, let's see you when I get more done The day I was at the thrift store and I found a ozone machine right down there BC works really well this is the first time I'm really using it for something to take odors away I looked online and it ranged from 100 to 150 160 dollars for one of those I cleaned it up cleaned the insides out it wasn't too bad but had some dust and lint and whatever but I paid $7.99 for it at a thrift store so I turned that on 
open up all the cabinet doors and going to just let it run for a few hours it's really not too bad but that those machines work really well You're taking odors out I used to have a I still have a leather jacket and sometimes it would get smoky cigarette smoke because I when I used to hang out at bars would come home and it would smell nasty of cigarettes so I would hang it in a small closet and have an ozone machine in there and it would just totally eliminate the odor from the leather jacket so I know they work so I'm gonna let this run for a while and let it take care of whatever remaining odors there may be so I'm getting pretty close to getting pretty close to laying down the flooring so this morning I vacuumed and vacuumed the floor again which I've done many times already but vacuum the floor clearing the floor of debris and whatever and uh, just getting ready I got some nice bamboo flooring that I got I'm gonna be putting that in I was gonna put cork flooring in it but long story short I wasn't able to get enough of the cork flooring what I needed so I switched to bamboo it's I'm gonna like it better I'm sure it's hard as like hardwood floor and it's got a nice shine to it it's gonna go good in here so <clears throat> looking forward to doing that I'm so anxious and ready to put it in but I know I've got a few other steps I gotta make to do before I do that so I gotta clean my windows I spray painted that one there and sprayed paint this one and there's like residue still from tape they put up here to block out the light so clean those up there's a lot of detailed work touch up paint cleaning stuff and repairing or replacing still haven't decided on that but going to clean it really well see how it looks need a few repairs to the doors yesterday got my latches and door door locks open like with this one here it wouldn't unlock but now it does all taken care of all right I'm gonna close up the door here and let it let the ozone machine do its thing got all the cabinet doors open of course yeah. Yeah, so I can get all in all the crevices all the areas that it needs to do to do its odor removal all right thanks for watching